All right, so on this build, we are going to make a chop saw stand across this wall. See right now, that is my chop saw stand. It's just, if this thing would focus, there it is, on the edge of my table saw, which is not the most convenient. So we're gonna build a chop saw stand on this wall and it's a perfect spot because then once I'm done cutting up I can just go on my lumber rack over there.
put a little, little shelving unit right here. It's gonna be my new parts bin. Um, I try to drink about a gallon of water a day, and down here in South Mississippi, when it gets really hot, I'll probably drink about two gallons a day. And the way I do that is this uh, crystal light stuff. So I have a bunch of these little containers laying around. And I go through these, about two of these a week. So they're gonna keep coming. I figured I'd just use these as my parts bin. And now all I gotta do is make the shelving units to hold them. I'll just write the label of what's in here on the top. This will work a lot better than what I have now. All right, now we gotta do with the enclosure for chop saw so there's not sawdust going everywhere. That's where we're gonna end this build. It's not completely done, but I need to move on and start working on some other projects. I have some customer orders I need to get out. And the chop saw stand is at the point where it makes my workflow so much more efficient. Rather than have to measure and cut all my boards, I can just move this stop block over and cut everything up. I still don't know what I want with the canvas in the bottom. Um, it's either gonna be obviously shelves or drawers, but I don't know what this shop needs the most right now. We're gonna wait until we get a couple more tools in and we have everything else a little bit more situated before we make that decision. Um, I also wanted to do a automatic stop lock, so you just enter the length of the board you want in a keypad and then your stop lock moves automatically. But have absolutely no time to figure that one out, so that's gonna be a project for the future. I really appreciate the fact that you guys decided to watch the whole video and stuck around this long. Um, if you could do me a favor and hit that thumbs up button, it helps a lot. And maybe even subscribe. I uh, hope you enjoyed the build and have a great day.